The equipment panel shows all machines associated with the account. It does not filter the equipment list based on farm, field, or grower. The equipment list will show active vehicles first and prioritize vehicles in the following order. Work, moving, traveling, idle, lost connection, and off. You may filter the equipment list by clicking the drop-down menu and selecting the preferred filter using the following options. 1. The type of equipment. Tractor, combine, windrower, sprayer, four-wheel drive tractor, and forage harvester, and two. Status, off, lost connection, or other. You may also filter the equipment by typing the name or serial number into the text box. Lastly, you can filter the map results by checking the box next to filter map results to view all the equipment listed in the map view area. You can refresh the equipment list at any time by clicking the refresh button located in the bottom corner of the equipment panel. Once you have located the vehicle, click on the vehicle preview picture to open a new equipment panel. You will notice that the map will zoom into and highlight the selected vehicle. The equipment details panel will open. This panel contains information about the vehicle and includes new quick access icons to remote display view, 24 hour location history, and directions to the latest vehicle location. You will also find highlighted CAN parameters and quick links to operators' manuals. You will notice that the information populated in the Equipment Details panel will change using the dynamic drop-down menu. Navigate to General Details to explore more options and discover even more information about your machine. Some of the information, including alerts and faults, are geo-referenced and allow you to view the exact location in a MAPS application. The 24-hour location history allows users to view the history of the vehicle in a select time frame. Start by selecting the time and date, then click Load. Click Play to view real-time CAN parameters. You may zoom into the map to see detailed breadcrumbs. The breadcrumbs are color-coded to indicate duty status. High-fidelity data will be available on select vehicles up to 10 days after work. This high-fidelity data can give users key insights to machine and operator productivity in the field. Finally, you may request a remote display viewing session by clicking on the RDV button under the Vehicle Preview or within the Equipment Details panel. The session does not require any additional software to be installed prior to the session. Simply click the RDV button to start the session. The operator will need to approve the request from the display. This feature is available in both web and mobile field ops applications.